How's it going everybody? Today, I'm gonna to be showing you how to change your wiper blade. I'm gonna start with doing the front wiper blades first. I actually um, took these off the car because I wanted to repaint them, but the concept still applies. And after I'm done with the front, I'm gonna do the one rear one, which I still have to take off and paint, but I'll show you how to replace the blade. So you probably wanna replace the blade because it has all dry rotted cracks and they just it just doesn't work as well. So I'm gonna show you how to do it on the front. So let's get started. So on some cars, you're going to have this little bracket here that comes in your case uh, for your new windshield wiper. Only on some cars, you'll need to attach that to, you know, whatever setting or distance this is. So usually you'd be the, uh, the middle setting. Um, but I don't need that for this case. So I have my wiper arm and I have the uh, wiper blade. And there's a little lip on the inside of the wiper blade that looks like this and you kind of hook you kind of have to hook the um, wiper arm to the wiper blade I'll show you in a second if I can angle the camera all right so you grab your wiper blade and uh, this is your wiper blade not this and what you do is you hook it on like this and you slide it until you hear a click once you hear that click it's perfectly on and then I'll put and then you put it on the car uh, mine's off the car right now, so you should already be good, but this is the driver's side. This is a uh, 21 inch. The passenger side is a 20 inch blade, and the rear is like a 17 or something like that. So there will be different size blades for, um, for, for each uh, wiper side. You can sometimes get them as a kit um, all together, or your local auto parts store will have like a little scanner. That you can like search your car on and and get all the specs and uh everything you need for uh for what wiper blade you need so i'm gonna put them on the car and i'm gonna see how good they work and the passenger side is the same deal uh you just do the same exact thing you know hook it on uh, until it locks and then you use them it's just pretty simple as that and it's not too expensive unless you can get like $30 wiper blades. These were like $11 wiper blades and and yes, they do matter. They're made of different uh, materials that last longer uh, Stop from rust uh, Forming or, or the rubber doesn't break down as much as in the Sun or chemicals in the winter time Depending on where you live doesn't break down the rubber and just overall quality There are winter blades summer blades better for rain better for uh, I don't know for winter snow, you know anything you need so yeah, I'm gonna put these on the car and see how they work. So I actually lied by accident. Um, I'm not going to be putting these uh, windshield wipers back on yet because I'm going to be making a video on how to use Plasti Dip to restore your black trim. And uh, I'm also gonna be painting this. So that's why I'm not putting the wiper blades back on because. I could either mask them and lift them up and paint it, but I, it's way easier just to do it off. Uh, so I'll be making a video on that soon. But I will be doing it on this uh, on this rear area here because I really want to take this arm off. But this is pretty simple. It's already on. It's right here. So I'm just going to unclip this, reclip the new one in, and show you how good it works and if everything works properly. So I have the car running right now. This is actually a higher quality blade. It had this uh, piece here to protect the rubber. It also has this plastic piece right here used as a clip. It's the same concept. You push these up and uh, you're able to slide that in to lock it. And then this is just like a safety cap. So you just put that on it to make sure everything's uh, working fine. So let me turn on the rear uh, blade if I can figure out how. There it is. So yeah. That's how a blade is supposed to work, and it's not supposed to make a screeching noise like it always does. So yeah, uh, I hope everyone enjoyed. So uh, I'm going to make some more videos and like little tiny how-to stuff. So yeah, uh, stay tuned for more. If you liked any part of this video, uh, you know, like the video, uh, watch all my other videos, and subscribe. See you later.